Hey, what's up? What's up, y'all? You already know who it is. Unique Gamer, aka Rabbit. Live, love. Um, we at it again. Uh, we back on. Um, jumping back in the story of Siri, the mage, with the unknown power within. Uh, she's seeking out her calling to be a mage, so she's gonna go to the College of Winterhold. Um, and we're just picking up, this is part three. We're picking up where we left off last. Um, you can check the videos on my page. Um, hit that like and subscribe. We're just gonna dive in, y'all. We're just gonna dive in. You know, let's go ahead and get it. see what happens with Siri. No matter what, the college will need. Well done indeed. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. About to get in. Winterhold's glory days may lie behind it, but the college lives on. She's kind of tall. Looking at it. Much knowledge lies within the college's walls. this game. Welcome to the college.
Welcome to the college. To come see you. We'll see what happens. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture. Alright, let's don these, uh, this new apparel. Oh, no, this. Okay. Okay. Let's we'll keep our boots and gloves. Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Delicate experience. Experience. Not so Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. You have that ass. That all kind. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Is like already addressing our new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. It's like this guy's following us for some reason. Anyway. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and see what's uh, going on. We're just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. 
Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Not going to weigh in either way? I admire your restraint, but there are times when you must make decisions, even without all the facts. Rely on instinct. We're all pretty neat, this right? Let's just give it a chance. What's the worst that could happen? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with a demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? Any ward spells? That's all right. I can I teach can you teach a very you basic ward, ward, one that's one enough for the purposes of this lesson. lesson. Now, now, if you just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the wall. Here we go. Over there, please. Just opposite me. I not want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. man gave me the lesser award spell. Okay. Beginner. I'm a beginner. Hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. First lesson's done, we're gonna hit Sarthal. Alright, let's see what these guys want. Fellow classmates. What's on they mat? What's on they bean cake? Colin. New here, New too, here eh? too, eh? I'd hoped I, I hoped wouldn't be the only Nord, Nord, but I should have known better. Know better. I mean, we don't really know our family, so we were in orphanage. Uh, okay. Magic, Magic is shunned is by most. If it can't be it can't swung, swung over your head and used to crack skulls, crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic, Magic is seen as something for elves, elves and weaker races. races. No, offense, no offense, of course. Not at all. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. blessing. My, family My family was convinced was coming, here coming here was a death sentence. Or worse, or worse. it took years, years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. Well, look at the evidence. Nords, Nords generally, generally don't, don't trust, trust magic, magic, so it's so not it's off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now with the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, 
Take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Now my other classmate turned his back like, nah, I ain't trying to hear him. That's wild. <laughs> Let's go talk to him and see what mm -hmm. he got to say. He just turned his whole back like, hey, not even with it. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Ah, this is good. But Gesargo will know them first. It is good to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Gesargo. We got the, uh, overjealous one here. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you can disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. <laughs> wow. Well, you know what? You must be very sure of yourself. There is much for Gizarda to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gizarda will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. Oh yes, yes. Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Find things to make you stronger. Siri really should look into that. Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod and the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gizargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Gizargo to become great. All right, then. Let's do a bit of exploring this college. You are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Please make sure your hands are clean before touching anything, all right?
fight well. You know, they say knowledge is its own reward. <clears throat> you... you can see me? Confound it all, I was quite sure I was invisible. Or at least transparent. I shall explain to you the mysteries of the outer realm. Turned out to be a little expensive. Let's lean back a little bit. Oh my, oh my. it's quite it's a difficult, quite a difficult question. question. Never, Never underestimate, underestimate the ability, the ability to, influence to influence others. others. Whether they're friends or foes, they're almost all susceptible to illusion spells. They can turn the tide of a battle in a moment's notice. There are also spells that help in avoiding conflict altogether. Invisibility is tricky to master, but exceptionally useful. Farewell. If you require assistance with summoning techniques, please, let me know. If you would, please also contain your summons to the college grounds. The locals do not need to be agitated further by Atronachs roaming their town. The summoning of undead is even less advisable outside the college. You've already learned all I can teach you. I sure know. Those archaic policies died out with the Mages' Guild, and were never enforced here. Necromancy, as any other type of magic, is a tool to be used. Of course, non-Mages may not see it that way, so we don't go around flaunting it. Not within society, no. Many who practice within the School of Conjuration do so on their own. Secretly. Falion is the only one I know who is public about what he does. He was once my teacher here, but left the college years ago. He didn't like the Archmage. Hated dealing with him. Hated having to answer to him. Falion said he hated what this place was becoming, so he just left. Aaron found a note on his desk, and that was it. I understand he settled down in Hjalmarch, and his presence there caused something of a problem. So, you wish to master the arcane arts?
You've already learned all I can teach you. Uh, until next time. Alright, let's head over to this uh, tomb or wherever it is that we're supposed to meet that. She was going on with that. start this mage stuff and in the next video after she does this um, we're going to explore the college a little more I'll, um, we'll just dive into more of the backstory of the college get an in-depth look it's real so-called guy he was talking about, the one that trained him, Conjuration. Unless, Unless you're, you're bringing, bringing me another round. round. He should be here, sleeping. Huh. He has money on the table for the taking. What's this guy? Low on me. No, even when... My days in college are laying behind me. Let's just keep an eye on close by. Such a chore to be stuck. Dagor and I have an understanding. He gives me privacy, and I make sure my experiments don't blow up his ears. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. So we come to him now. He has conjuration spells too, as you can see. Basically the same, basically the same things. Nothing really different. Uh, steadfast ward don't increase armor rating. No less award we have. Okay. Until next time. time. The mage is still... Aster, Aster says his paw says the college makes lots of bad things happen. But the mages have seen look nice. nice. The little people in this game. Jump on the horse we bought. Last episode. And... We're... Grab these snowberries. These come in handy later. And we'll see why later on. But she 
gets our house. Daddy bear. Oh, where did my horse go now? He's such a scary cat.
Siri likes to use, which we haven't been using right now because I'm trying to build up this destruction magic. So there's a cave up there, and the fact that we haven't let dragons in yet, we should check out the dragon thing up there too before heading over to the side. Uh, yeah, we'll head over there and we'll do some exploring. Can't hurt, right? Yes, sir. Legion's always looking for strong, strong capable warriors. warriors. If you think you've got what it takes, our headquarters are in solid. Okay. Can I join an Imperial Legion? Where did this thing mark over that?
building right here. The shrine seems to be right up here. So. Can we get up there? Skyrim mechanics. Hoppity hop. Uh, I don't think this is the way to the shrine. There has to be another way. But. Siri in our athletic ways. She's scaling the mountain. We'll reach the top to find. Oh, there's a shrine. Maybe we shouldn't have came all the way up here to get to the shrine, but maybe we might find a way down. Let's just hope. So we got this Siri. Shine, this is. Hmm, I'm excited. Azora. Okay. Okay, Azora. Someone's here. Azura, Azura has, seen has seen your coming, coming traveler. traveler. It was not it's curiosity, not but fate what? has led you here. Azura, Azura has, given has, has given me the me gift, gift of foresight. foresight. I, had I had a vision, a vision of you walking, walking up the steps to this altar long, long before you were born. You, you have, have been, been chosen, chosen to be her, her champion. champion. I know I it know is unexpected, is but do not do worry. Not. It will all unfold as she has presumed. Although I'm no one's champion. Uh, I'm curious. I'll bite. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they name this elven enchanter. Find an elven mage. Okay, from her vision. She is the goddess of dawn and dusk. Azura sees into the twilight of the future and guides her followers through. Okay. My people, the Dunmer, built it. We fled from Morrowind after Vardenfell erupted almost 200 years ago. Those of us who were faithful to Azura were given a vision that led us away from the island before the worst came. This shrine is our thanks to her, that none will forget that she watches over us all. May Azura's magic protect you. So, this mission the black star. This may be pretty useless for Siri. Although we'll go do the Sardau first and we'll do the Black Star in the next video. Yeah. We also got the creature of legend that also is a mission from what to hold that we'll tackle as well. But let's get back on course. Kind of 
got away from what we were doing. mission. We're just going to get back on mission right now. That's what we're going to do. Right here. Oh, look who decided to come back after running off and leaving me alone. You're not serious. Took so long, guys. And here we all are. Shall we step inside? Study stars, you say? Why, there hasn't been a mage doing anything related to stars since. Ooh. Well, it's a minor stain on the college of reputation. One of many, unfortunately. You should head to the frozen hearth and speak with Nelikov. It's his story to tell. And I wouldn't want to discredit him by talking behind his back. So it's Nelikov. Oh, Nelikar. Nelikar. That deals with us, or... Okay. We'll check that out. So what's on? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. What are we looking for? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students, that would be a happy coincidence. How much 
I can target. certainly yes. share a bit of what I know. Two fifty. Okay. I'll learn a little bit. There we go. I appreciate you. Let's go check this place out. All right. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. Follow him, but is he gonna move? I don't know. Huh? My boy took forever to make his move. I don't know what's going on. I'll go in first, man. I find it hard to believe this excavation is approved. Who knows what we might find in here? Yeah, that was the real. The infamous Night of Tears. Not much is known about what happened to Sarthor. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such a truly civilization and the magic thing. This is better than sitting around well, talking. Are there any questions before we begin? Let's get to it. Well, why don't you see if you can assist on your game? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruin rooms. Any enchanted items will do. The use of these enchanted is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class will look it over. Now let's see. What shall we have the rest of us do? Berliner, yeah, my dear. Just that's what I'm doing. Search for warding magics. Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them. Just identify them. All right. All right. Let's be careful. Let's have fun. Jazar finds nothing but dust in these ruins. Do you think there's treasure here? Because Tolstoy says so. He says there are things to learn here. Hmm. May you walk on one side. My boy eating them little, eating them, them burger buns. Let's see what we do over there. Please 
be careful here. Yeah. The site is not entirely secure. Heard you, heard you, heard you. Yeah, hey, well, I'm looking for. Don't touch anything. Whoa. That was crazy. Who's he talking to? What? what? Ah, yes. It's you. you. I remember you. You're going, You're going to, help? to help? That's fine, That's fine. Justice. Just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh, you can look around in the changes just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Just round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. Gotcha. All right, then. Was that racket? Is everything all right? Oh, here we go. Wrapped in here. How in the oh, world did that happen? Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Look at that. This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. I'm not sure. I certainly wasn't expecting this. This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. Don't you go first. Mm -hmm. chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment, Judgment has, has not, not been passed. passed. 
as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed just because the Sijic Order believes in you. You, mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? You serious? The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? First tell me, what's the Sigic Order? They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. Why is the Sigic Order contacting me? I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, true, of course. The Isle of Arteum had disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sigics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Well, Siri is trying to be a powerful mage. Mm -hmm. Digging in. Be prepared to defend yourself. Wow, that's dwarven plate boots. Didn't think I would find that in here. Uh. Oh, I'm pretty good. This is simply fascinating. Prepare to defend yourself. Hey, buddy. Be prepared to defend yourself. Be prepared to defend yourself. Seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before? 
I just look at all these coffins. This bears closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. Be prepared to defend yourself. All right, then. God sent me on my own, the student.
back of it and it actually shows what it should be. So dolphin, dolphin. Yeah. That's an eagle. Okay. Should be good now. Perfecto. It was good. Scared. 
Lake Dolphin. What could this place be? I don't know, but I'm going all the work. Yeah, what's your job? There's a door here. I knew you would have stepped on it. I knew you would have stepped on it. in and see what Okay. 
stuff. Oh, poor guy. Simply fascinating. Is it not? What is this thing? I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Sabo Saran of this discovery? Please, hurry. All right, guys. I think we're going to go ahead and... Go ahead and... End it right here. We have to go back to the college and inform them of whatever this may be. Head back to the college. Uh, there he is diving into her story, becoming the maid she wants to be. Oh, and we also found a staff that she might keep in her arsenal. Haven't decided yet. Uh, we also got this bow that looks interesting, but the staff is more important. And then, does there have any war hammers, two-handed weapon? Uh, she may just be collecting it. She gets a house and stores it up somewhere. Like, hey, that's the first ebony weapon I got. Um, but all in all, it was a great journey for Siri right now. First little act in her journey. Uh, gonna do a little bit of exploring before she heads back to the college. But all in all, every story will continue. The 
prepared to defend yourself. Oh, he's still saying prepare myself. Uh, be prepared to defend myself. Ain't that stuff? So yeah, we'll end it here. And thank you guys for watching. Unique gamer, you already know.